you guys are doing great. Welcome back to our channel. Guys, we are in Solar Devana Hali, which is in the Yashwantpur area of Bangalore. A lot of you people were demanding about accommodations in the Yashwantpur area, and Solar Devana Hali will be a great option. It is approximately seven kilometers away from the Christchurch Yashwantpur campus. A lot of you people wanted to know about student accommodations there, and finally today we are touring Stanza Living. Now, along with Christ University students, there are also students from Acharya Institutes that stay in these properties. Guys, without any further ado, we will quickly give you a tour of the rooms, talk about the facilities and the cost. So make sure you watch this video till the very end. Let's get started. Guys, I'm with Mr. Sri, who is the resident captain of the Tacoma House here at Santa Living. Welcome, sir. And uh, welcome to the Santa Living. I will show you around the property. Sure. Guys, uh, this is the mini recreational area that they have. I can already see some students playing. I'll quickly give you tour of the room now. That's the room, sir. Yeah. The table chair. Yeah, this is the table chair. Okay. Great work. All right, guys. This is the triple sharing room with the balcony. First and foremost, there are three beds and three study tables. Along with that, there are three cupboards for each of the individuals. There is good amount of space here. Uh, there is a balcony with a good view, decent view. Then there is the washroom. Uh, you have the wash basin here, the WC, as well as the bathing area this side. Uh, the most awaited part, I guess, of this room is going to be the balcony. So come and give you a tour of that. Wow. Okay, guys, this is the balcony with a great view. Uh, it looks really very good. Plus, obviously, I think the lots are here so people can dry the clothes up. For triple sharing room, this is a must because, like you know, then you're going to be sharing your room with three people. So, an outdoor space is like a great advantage. Now, I'm giving you a tour of the double sharing room. All right. So, this is going to be the double sharing room for boys. First of all, lots of good space. At the same time, there are going to be two beds, study table. One study table is here, and the other is here. A great part in these rooms is that there's also storage on the top, so you know you can keep your bags or things that you don't need. And then there will be two individual cupboards with locks that are going to be given to you students. So which is great, and you know you can store all your things. And then there's a drawer to keep your valuables as well. Pretty good. Uh, come and quickly give you a tour of the washroom. Before to the washroom, first of all, a great window for ventilation and a good view, which is super good. This is the washroom, guys. So you have the wash basin, the bathing area is here, and the WC is here. Plus there are shelves here to keep you know your extra belongings. Pretty good room, very very neat and tidy, and they look very new because the whole of the building is new. Guys, I'm going to show you the four sharing room in the boys' property. Come, let's go. By the way, this is my first time that I'm touring a four sharing room. Uh, I'm super excited. All right, so this is how it looks. Uh, it looks like a hall with a lot of space. There are four beds and four study tables for each of the individuals. Uh, unlike usually the four sharing rooms to be cramped, this is a lot of space. Plus, you have cupboards for each of the four people. So you know, uh, each one of them will get one of their own cupboards, which is great. Uh, along with that, guys, unlike a usually like a four sharing or triple sharing, we just get one bathroom. Here you'll be having two different washrooms. So no, you know, waiting for like are you coming out or you know I'm waiting kind of a thing. So come, let's take a tour of the first washroom. So this is how it looks. You have the WC, the bathing area, as well as the wash basin. This is the other washroom. So guys, uh, this has the WC, the wash basin, and the bathing area. Looks very very good. Um, lot of space, guys, and I'm sure when four boys are under one roof. They are just going to have the maximum amount of chilling. Guys, I'm moving towards the food area of the boys' hostel. So, guys, this is the dining area. Just in all Santa colors, you have tables here. This is where your food will be laid out. It's in a buffet style, so you can eat as much as you want to. Then there's also a fridge that is there. Along with these things, uh, you would be provided with an induction, a toaster, and a microwave. So for any of your essentials, there's something that you would want to do, you can do it. Uh, looks very nice, plus it's on the top floor, so it's very breezy and windy here. 
uh, you also have a TV, so you know you can listen to uh, whatever you want to listen or watch while you're eating, which is super good. Guys, I was talking to a few students down there, and they were like, "View from the top is not to be missed, and it's actually the truth. It looks very, very calm and serene. Uh, it's windy, breezy, uh, looks very good, and then you have the view of whole of Bangalore here. Literally, looks super good." Guys, we are now walking towards Managua House, which is the girls' property for Sandra Living. Guys, we are with Aisha, ma'am, who is the resident captain of Managua House, and ma'am will help us take a tour of the property. So guys, this is the common area. So the rooms here are in the two BHK style, where one room is a triple sharing room, and the second room is a double sharing room, along with a common area, a kitchen, and two bathrooms, of course. So come, let's go and first tour their room. So this is the triple sharing room. Wow, it's pretty spacious. So it has three beds and along with that, three huge cupboards. They also have a beautiful window here for some ventilation and good air. Now coming to the washroom, they have a WC, a shower along with a geyser. So you can just choose when you want to switch it on, switch it off, how you would like it. Looks pretty spacious. So this is basically the reason why people prefer the 2BHK model because it gives you so much common area to just chill and relax. So this is the common washroom. So like that one was attached with the room. This one is attached to the common room. Again the same thing, it has the WC, the wash basin and the geyser. So guys, now let's go to the double sharing room. So now we are in the double sharing room. As you can see, there are two beds, a beautiful big window right here with a lot of light and ventilation and an amazing view. Oh my god, the breeze. Moving on, we have an amazing cupboard of two, which is huge for two people. But not to forget, we also have extra storage up there. So overall, this is a very neat, very spacious, yet with good storage room. So guys, now we are in the kitchenette. So this again is a common area for all the people staying in the 2BHK where you get extra storage and you can keep some food for your midnight craving or just extra storage. <laughs> Guys, we are walking towards the common area for the girls which is at Managua house but right now just look at the amazing view uh, in Sola Devina Halli. This looks very very mesmerizing. Come let's go. So guys, just like every other Sansa property, this property has an amazing lot of space for your recreational and dining needs. So this is where they serve the food. As you can see, there's non-veg as well as veg. And there is the small pantry. So they have a microwave, an induction, a toaster. This is for common use of all the students staying here. They also have a refrigerator in case your ice cream needs some time in the fridge. There are these amazing seating with green glass windows. And of course, there is Karen, vodka which we are to get defeated now. <laughs> and there is a seating with bean bag where you can sit with your friends. Chill, have fun, have a cup of coffee maybe. 
Let's you have an amazing view outside. Guys, Pavni is trying her luck at it again, but trust me, the result is just going to be the same. Anyways, guys, we are almost towards the end of our tour of the Stanza Living properties around the Yashwantpur area. Thank you so much for watching this video till the very end. Now I'm pretty sure you are looking in for all the information, and don't worry, I will take this while to answer each and every doubt that you might have. First and foremost, regarding distance, I'm pretty sure that you will always be really concerned that oh my God, it's you know seven kilometers away from the Christ Church Yashwantpur campus. So how do we go about it? First and foremost, just like all the Stanza Living properties, there are something called Stanza Bike. Which means you can rent a bike per day, per month, few per hours. So all of that is available in each of these properties. So you know you can rent a bike and probably get a friend of yours in pool in, and then you know go to the campus and then come back. That is going to be one great thing. Along with that, just because a lot of Christites will be staying in these properties, so you know you will easily be able to pull in an auto or a cab to go to the uh, you know college and then come back. Uh, along with that, this is Solar Devana Halli area, but there is also Mathikere area. Both Solar Devana Halli area. And the Mathikeri area are very well developed for student communities. In my previous videos, also I've repeatedly told this again and again because in the Solar Devana Halli area, there is Acharya Institute that already is there. Or in Mathikeri area, there is MS Ramaya that is there. So a lot of student community is developed. You'll be easily be able to get like cheap food, good cafes, uh, and good accessibility to the city. So rather than staying in that area, you can prefer to stay in this area and with again flexibility of like a stanza bike or you know regularly traveling with an auto or Uber or something like that. So that can be solved. Along with that, they have this cool thing that for lunch you don't need to come here. So they, you will pack your lunch in the morning itself. So whenever you're eating your breakfast, you can take your lunch to the campus, and you know you can save your cost of that as well. In terms of the facilities that are here, just like every Stanza property, this includes each and everything. Uh, the cost includes food, electricity, Wi-Fi, maintenance. Uh, there are guards that are available, CCTV camera, resident captains. Uh, you know, I mean, each and everything that you would find across is available, so you do not need to worry about that. Everything is managed and you know monitored through the Stanza app, so you know you can download that. Uh, so that is all going to be really very cool. I will be putting down in the description of this video the details of all the Stanza Living properties around Solar Devana Halli area, even as Mathikeri area. So in case you want to stay that area, uh, you can choose to do that as well. So now coming to the part that everyone's been waiting for. So the costing of the properties that we showed you. So for the girls' property, that was the Managua house. The triple sharing is eight thousand plus GST, and the double sharing is ten thousand three hundred plus GST. Now this cost is all per month per person. Moving on to the boys' property, the Tapuma, the double sharing is ten thousand two hundred plus GST. Triple sharing is eight thousand four hundred plus GST. And the four sharing is seventy nine hundred plus GST. Wow, these prices are pretty pretty cheap, which is great. And of course, this is living in a community like like this. this, and guys, this is inclusive of everything. I mean, GST too, you have to pay everywhere. But other than that, each and every facility that I've talked about uh, is inclusive in this cost. So this is super good. Thank you so much for watching this video till the very end. This was a very heavily demanded video of student accommodation around Yashwantpur area. So I hope uh, I have done justice, and I hope you guys like this video. Uh, thank you so much, guys, for watching this video till the very end. Uh, if you like this video, please smash the like button. Please stop doing it. Uh, okay. Please comment below if you have any doubts, question, queries, anything regarding student accommodation of Christ Church Yashwantpur campus, anything regarding Stanza Living. Please make sure you comment below. I will show you the reply. Last Please share this video yes. with your friends to let them know about this beautiful property out here. Also, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get regular notifications of every time we upload a video. Yes, guys, take care. Bye, bye. Bye.